Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. I want to make uh, one more video here about YouTube analytics. Um, and uh, I think some of the sort of really basic functionalities, you're just looking to report on um, your channel growth and look at views by month and um, look at subscriber count by month. I think sometimes you're not the most um, intuitive to find. So the first thing I'm gonna do, and this is a personal preference, is jump into the advanced mode um, so that I can get as much info as possible out of the dashboard. And the first thing when I pop into this, and it's only every few months, but um, I like to check subscriber count by month. So I'm gonna just show you guys how to do that. So firstly, go across to the date uh, tab here. Second thing I'm gonna do is because um, looking at monthly, let's say the last 365 days. So we're gonna be looking at, we can either look at trailing one year or we can just look at 20, let's just look at 2022, given that we're now um, in the progress of the fifth month that I'm recording this video on the 4th of May of 2022 okay so by default the um the measurement interval is going to be daily so i'm going to go ahead and change that over to monthly now because uh we're in the fifth month so we only have one two three four data points that have been fixed and the fifth data point is in progress because may we've just started may uh obviously I'm, as i said i'm recording this on the fourth so this is basically it you can see and it's organized according to the month so you can see uh what how many views you got each month so i can see in may uh so far um i've got one six five nine 20, 80 hours 80 watch hours rounded out and last month for instance uh fifteen thousand. so that's that's just a quick gives you kind of a quick you can see that my best month so far this year has been march and april are pretty much neck and neck there's only a difference of about 100 views in it and a watch time difference of not so much um, so if you look at that data over a year, I'm gonna stretch stretch it out back to last three, six, five days here. I'm gonna keep the reporting interval as monthly. And now you can see May, April, March, Feb, Jan. And now we're looking back. So this is last year, May through December. And if I look at January in the graph, then um, so we can see that the overall trend, uh, t my 2022 so far versus 2021 is a little bit better. Um, the last month, uh, March, April, it's picked up, which makes sense because I've been doing more uploading. Now, the second uh, thing I think would be more would be is useful is to see your subscriber count uh, by date. So what I would do here is on the top left, you've got views by date. And you can go ahead and change that over to subscribers. And you're actually, I'm not even using the second metric because it just makes it confusing, but you can overlay, uh, for instance, views, and then you're gonna get two lines plotted on the graph. I'm gonna go ahead and take that off and just keep it simple. So what we're looking at now, and I'm gonna go back to 2022 firstly, is the delta or the change in the subscriber count by month. Now there's something uh, you may notice that's different here, and that's that it's actually not gonna order. The table down here is not ordered uh, chronologically. So you can see, for instance, it goes March, April, January, February, then May, so it's actually ordered according to subscribers. And to the best of my knowledge, there's no way to sort the table on date, which is a little bit negative. But one thing you can do if you don't like the way it's being presented is you can always just uh, extract the data here as a um, as a Google Sheet. Uh, so I can do that and sort it any way I like. But um, I'll just show you how that data will present itself. So you can do your own charting and bring it into different programs and different things like that. But I'm gonna stick with what's on the dashboard for the moment. So we can see that the, del the, the change in subscribers in January was 45. Now, as the little box I'm hovering over says here, the change in total subscribers is found by subtracting subscri subscribers lost from, subscri from subscribers gained for the selected date and region, and my region is worldwide. So um, so basically it's possible to have both a negative, uh, it, it's, it's possible to have a negative value. So if you lost gained 10 subscribers and lost 20, your value would be minus 10. My values are all positive. As you can see, they're pretty small. Um, in January, I picked up 45 subscribers or gained 45. In January, gained 44. In March was my best month so far this year. I picked up 53 new subscribers or the average or the gain, I should say, came out to 43. In April, 48. And in May month to date, I'm at five. So uh, that is how you can do that. And you can just, again, look at the chart. It's probably easier than breaking down in the table. 
and you can get a sense for um, in terms of the subscriber growth um, what your trend what your trend line is looking like and uh, you can of course also as it says filter on uh, geography as well but you can do that by doing the filter and then you can add a geography filter so I can look only for data from uh, let's say from let's say from Israel where I'm based so I'm click Israel apply and now we're only looking at Israel I actually haven't had any uh, uh, subscribers so I guess I'm that's interesting Anyway, I'm not going to get in, into the, into filtering because that's adding another layer of complication. If you're just looking to see your view changes and your subscriber changes month to month, uh, this is a way to do it. Go into your Google Anal uh, sorry YouTube Analytics. Uh, this is showing how to do it in the Analytics tab. Jump over to Date, and then on Date, you can change between your subscribers, views, watch hours, even average view duration. Uh, you can change the reporting increment here in this between daily, weekly, monthly, yearly. And you can change the date range up here and that's pretty much all there is uh, to it thank you guys for watching if you want to get a new video new videos from me please subscribe to the youtube channel